Hey everybody, welcome back to Sketchy Goichi, doing another Quad Squad. If anyone uh, is playing at home, divide, it in, divide your page into four and put four basic shapes in there and then let your creativity take over. How I do it is um, in Procreate, which is my uh, app of choice, I uh, essentially on one layer create that line, that cross down the middle, on another layer create the four box well, not boxes, but the four shapes to go within the boxes, or the quadrants, hence the quad. And um, and then I render on top, like I have with this little sort of zombie half skull shape thing. And the whole point of this video was to kind of stress and emphasize line weight and line quality. Um, I know a lot of young artists struggle with this. It's something obviously you gotta practice, practice, practice. Yes, I am talking about practice, again, but it's essential and study too I mean see you know see other artists that uh, that you respect and sort of try to emulate their line and that's exactly what I'm doing here I mean it really is just you know kind of an amalgam of all my favorite inkers over the over the many decades and that's all it takes it's just you kind of go in there and study the line and see where where it's the thickest and where it's the thinnest uh, oftentimes for me, I like that thick, super thick, chunky outer line. Um, it's not a, it's not absolutely essential. As a matter of fact, a lot of the new art really uh, is rendered without any line at all. It's just kind of filling uh, colors or, or grade uh, grades of colors. But I like the hard line, and I'm going to continue to use hard line. And it basically creates like I like that sticker quality to these. I feel like any one of these could be a sticker until I go in here and <laughs> decide to throw another layer. So we're talking, this is the fourth layer, and it's just a shadow layer. Um, how I'm able to get the shadow layer without, you know, to render it without it affecting the line art is very, very simple. You just um, place it underneath the line art layer. So literally, it, it, the black line will not be affected by this, this sort of gray tone that I'm adding in. And, and that's, I mean, that's the, uh, the gist of it. I mean, it's just, you know, pick a light source and, and kind of go after it uh, or go into it <laughs> or away from it, whatever the case may be. So weird, random head shapes. The one in the upper left-hand quadrant, which I'm applying the white highlight to. Again, zombie head. The one just to the right to it of it is the, um, I don't know, some kind of weird helmet, <laughs> space helmet the little demon or little devil character, goofy devil character, and this kind of wacky aquatic, kind of quasi aquatic looking guy. Um, but the point is, nice thick bold outer line, sort of nice tapered line, and I think it gives it all really cool energy. So work on it, practice it, um, and that's how you get better. It's the only way. So. Sketchy go eat you guys. Live your moment. Happy sketching, y'all. By the way, leave a comment. And of course, subscribe. Peace.